Hi everyone, I'm Ivan from Webwash and today I'll give you a quick introduction into the Shield module for Drupal. If you want to learn more about Drupal, check out our website at webwash.net or follow us on Twitter at webwashnet. What is the Shield module? The Shield module gives you the ability to lock down websites behind an, an Apache authentication like this. Okay? This is useful for dev and staging sites that need to be online, but you want to control who has access to them. You can, you can implement this type of authentication a few ways, but by using the Shield module, you don't have to play around with Apache, just configure the module and you're done. Let's now test it out. So here I have my development site. I'll just go to modules and search for shield and then enable. To configure the module, just go to configuration and shield. From here, we can configure the username. So let's just add in admin, password. Let's just add in admin again for this demo and let's hit save. And straight away, we get the Apache authentication. Okay, so let's just log in. But one thing to be careful of is this authentication message. Pretty much this, this message will display the username and password. So let's just change this to, uh, let's call it welcome, welcome dev and hit save. Now, if we log out, we should see a message which says, welcome dev. So let's just log out and there you go. See a message called welcome dev. Let's act as if we stumbled across the website and all we need to do is log back in. And that's it. If you want to set up a workflow where, th where the shield module is only enabled on a development site, then look at the environment modules module. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment.